oppression. It's an unavoidable fact. Oppression's been ingrained into the very fabric of human history. And you know what? I know a lot of people are being oppressed. But the worst of all is the oppression that's taken place right in front of our faces. The one that everyone's too afraid to talk about. His story. The untold story of oppression of white males in America. I mean, nobody has it harder than us white heterosexual males in America. I mean, everybody's trying to oppress us. I mean, you even remember the last time we had a white president? When's it gonna be our turn? Can't even walk through my own neighborhood anymore without feeling like I'm just being oppressed from from every angle. Dumb. 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 Excuse me, sir. Hmm? I'm just looking for the Whole Foods. I can't even enjoy a meal in peace these days without being oppressed. I was trying to enjoy a sandwich, just minding my own business when, when I noticed this man glaring at me. He's just staring at me and just, he was just menacing me for no reason. I think he was probably a Mexican fellow of some sort. He was probably just happily thinking about all the white jobs he had stolen. He probably thought to himself, hey, Maybe I steal me a white sandwich, too. Hi! Hmm? Me? Mm. Uh, 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 and, and now we have gay people everywhere and they're just trying to oppress all of us straight people into a homosexual lifestyle, and most of us don't even want to be gay. Not even a little bit. <laughs> Isn't that shirt a little racist? Well, th these? This ain't racist. You're racist for saying it's racist. All I'm trying to say is that why dedicate an entire month to just one group of people? And why isn't there a white man history month? And then of course there's the worst oppression that white men have incurred through all of human history done to us by our worst enemy, women. My white male boss was replaced by a woman at work and within just one day, I began menstruating. No, it's impossible for a man to menstruate. What he suffers from is actually what we in the medical field call terminal masturbation. His sexual frustration is so overwhelming that he's literally torn his penis to shreds. I ask when, when will it be enough for you? When will you stop trying to put the white man down? I mean, the oppression of white, completely and utterly heterosexual men is just gone on long enough. Well, like the Bible and, uh, and Obamacare.